Welcome back to Asura's Wrath. Stupid. Stupid. Yep. Stupid. Stupid. Now what we're doing here is uh, we are not going to be jumping into the fourth arc right away. We're going to be taking care of these two lost episodes that they also uh, released. These aren't the same thing as the .5 episodes we did. These are brand new episodes that are completely disconnected from the story themselves. And the reason being is because of... Oh, wait a minute! Yeah! Okay. Asura versus Ryu. This is the Street Fighter, I guess, 4 crossover event series OVA nonsense. Oh, cool! Because the game was published by Capcom, after all. Yeah, I actually heard about this a long time ago. And they did this separately, and I noticed there was a little subtitle saying they didn't bother to dub these parts. No, nah, they're just in Japanese. I mean, that's they, fine. It's just... Well, I mean, probably you, because they couldn't get Kyle A. Bear to do Ryu. Well, I mean... They probably still could have brought him along. Yeah, maybe, but... Oh, well. We got what we got here, so... Okay. Well, Ryu's looking pretty good. Go ahead, fight the God of Anger. Let's see what happens. Yeah, this, this is gonna go pretty well. So, round one. <gasps> Dude! It's typical type of... Oh, wait! <laughs> cool! It's basically just like 2D Street Fighter, except you have all of Asura's moves and his move set. Really? Uh-huh. Dude! You count, count it the same way, you jump the same way. He's being a little prick right now. <laughs> and now you know why I don't play Street Fighter. Yeah, this is what, I'm more of a Tekken guy, really. I've always been more of a Tekken guy. By the way, waiting for my Tales of Tekken to come out. <laughs> Devil Jin going up against Estelise, that'll be great. Dude, that'd be so cool. Oh god, come on, dude. Fight. I'm not doing so good here, but... Fight back! He, he, he blocks, though. He blocks a lot. Because the AI in Street Fighter is a bunch of cheating bitch. No fucking shit. I don't think Street Fighter even has a sort of, you know, oh, you're blocking too much. You better stop doing that because Soul Calibur does that, Tekken does that, and Blaze Blue does that. So why didn't Street Fighter do that, too? No, Soul Calibur is the worst when it comes to cheating AI, but Street Fighter's not too far behind it. Yeah. There we go. So, all right, knocked him out. So that's it, right? No, there is more than one street fighter. More than one street to fight on. So I win, but... Oh, they didn't want to say awesome. Oh, no way! So now, Ryu's back in the fight. Hmm. It just, just restarts over again, so what do we do? Oh, the burst gauge! Uh-huh. Oh, you need to take him out like, mm -hmm. like Asura take him out. Oh, God. That's cool. Let's build up this gauge and really take him out. Absolutely destroy him. Make it so that he never comes back. I'm also trying to bait him into using his ultra combo because he will do that. Oh, seriously? Mm -hmm. The Shinku Hadouken or something like that? S something like that. I'm trying to goad him into doing that so I can show that off, but... No dice? Yeah, not gonna work. Oh, well. Oh, I knocked him out again, though. <laughs> Oops. Nice little se uh, secondary victory animation. Hmm, never gets past seven. No, because he always... Alright, let me, let me try to beat this guy. But now what we're going to do is we're going to just hit R2 and just... Whoa! Uppercut him to the heavens and back. Jeez! He's dead. <laughs> yes, a mere mortal will not survive this, especially going into space. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh. Uh, Asura, Houston, we have liftoff. Oh, uh, are you fucking dead? Fatality. <laughs> when do we get that? Asura in Mortal Kombat, he'd be more... Yeah, he'd probably do way better there. Holy shit! Shiva has four arms, but he has six and... Oh, shit. Oh, Dark Ryu! Who can survive the moon somehow? 
Maybe, I'd like to think evil Ryu can survive oh, the evil. moon, but vanilla Ryu can't. So he needs to call in the evil side. So his white gi turns black. It doesn't make much sense to me. He's slowly turning into Akuma. I mean, what if he was wearing a black gi and then he turned evil? Would it, like, turn white? <laughs> He'd block out the sun somehow. <laughs> So now we're gonna face evil Ryu. Ooh. Hmm. Aw, oh, sweet. So is this canon? Technically? No. Uh no. Well, I mean, the scabbard's still up here. Uh, scabbard's still up here. Is this after Mithra was saved? I mean, is this like after the fake ending? The fake episode 18, I guess? I don't. Maybe this is during. Hmm. <laughs> So, I hate evil Ryu. Oh. Oh. Oh, Cause, no. Because my typical uh, plan of action is to jump and then mass circle, which locks on. But what Ryu loves to do is he loves to counter that with a Shoryuken. Oh. 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 Not only that, but he has like 15 trillion different moves, and I still have my, well, five. See, he just always does that Shoryuken! Always blocking me, always countering. That's why I'm playing on normal mode this time. And this doesn't have any... Like, there's... Are there any trophies attached to this besides beat it? Like, I think the only trophies there are for is uh, like, maybe beating it and... Uh, but I think it's for clearing all the missions. I'll show that off after this. Oh, 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 oh god! Oh. Thought I could counter that with something, but no! Nope. Oh dear, you're getting your ass handed to you. This, is, this isn't going well, no. Oh, oh god! <laughs> that was cool. What happened? That was cool. Yeah, I, gotta, I gotta turn this around somehow. You know, I'm actually surprised that Osra hasn't come back to, like, any fighting game. Like, you know, they could put him in Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite, because crossover characters are apparently the big thing in this year. Oh shit. And I'm loving it. I love crossover characters. They're great. I, I just want Osiris to be in more things. <laughs> just be in something. He's a great character. I mean, okay, how's this? Osiris versus Kratos. How's I would that? love it. That'd be great. Just a whole bunch of <laughs> battle of angry. Go. And then they team up to fight like I don't know Zeus or. Uh, Vishnu or something. See, that'd be fucking awesome! There we go. Oh, nice! Oh, oh this gonna go good. Oh, oh, oh. no, oh, no, oh, no! Boom! Oh. Oh. <laughs> that was brilliant. I don't know what he did, but I hope he uh, didn't miss his pelvic bone. Oh, oh. sorry. <laughs> don't stop that the was, action! That was so awesome, the capture fucked up. <laughs> Damn it. Why is why is the capture always fuck up with this game? Uh, probably because the frame rate is a mess. I mean, the PS3 had an update a few days ago. It was like an update. They still update this thing? It's supposed to help like stability pr improvement or whatever. It's like, oh, maybe it'll make Rasura's Wrath run better, but nope. uh, no. And, and... What? Oh, 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 oh! Watch, 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 watch! Yeah, just hit all buttons. What? <laughs> cool. Yeah, okay. Does it really help your case? Oh, yeah, it does. And then his head explodes. I want to, I'll just say the moon has gravity and atmosphere just for... You're pretty good. That wasn't the true me. Let's have another go. Uh -huh. You'll just end up losing. <laughs> just hear him say that shit. And oh, then hello. a new challenger has arrived. Who could it be? Turns out it's Angief. <laughs> 
He's the size of Wizen! It's Rose. <laughs> what? Huh? Holy shit, Whoa. it's the... <laughs> it's the, uh, boxing glove kangaroo from Tekken! Whoa! <laughs> I think that was in Tekken. Maybe I'm thinking Streets of Rage. I don't know. No, you're, no, it's Tekken. Okay. I don't know Tekken as well as you do. Now it's Akuma! Oh, That's next time! Shit, what? Next time. Oh, there really? Are two lost episodes, my friend. Oh, yeah, you fight Ryu, you fight Evil Ryu, and then you fight Akuma. See, I already knew about this, but... Are there any other lost episodes? No. Nope. Okay. No. I wanted there to be like, oh man, imagine if if Asura came up against all the other Capcom greats. Like maybe he went into, you know, medieval times and did like a Dungeons and Dragons or even like a Dragon's Dogma type thing or whatever. That'd be cool. Or maybe he uh, he goes into another world and he stomps on someone and he gets arrested and so he he has to go to court and then uh, you see see how I'm going here and then. Uh, <laughs> A dinosaur comes in, and it's a Dino Crisis crossover, actually. So. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, they're in Raccoon City. Holy fuck. <laughs> Need to kill a bunch of zombies. See, that's what I think is hilarious about Capcom Heroes, the new mode coming to Dead Rising 4. They brought <laughs> they brought back beautiful Joe, for God's sake, but no Asura. Do you know how no awesome Asura. it would be to destroy zombies as the god of anger? Beautiful See, Joe, that, Amaterasu. What else I think it might be is that maybe uh, Asura doesn't belong to Capcom. Yeah, it maybe, might like be maybe. more of a CyberConnect thing. Yeah, it might be CC2 who owns this, but uh, I, I would not mind a Project Barracuda 2, you know? Mm-hmm. Because CyberConnect 2 is... They're being wasted. Wasted! On these fucking Naruto games. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> they can't even make a Dragon Ball Z game, really? I uh, think they make a great DBZ game, but we got Fighter Z to tide us over until then. But you uh huh, know. yeah, Arc System Works has that down pat right now. Uh huh, uh huh. Uh -oh. I'm just saying, Cyber Connect Two can do so much more than make shitty DS games that happen to be the rarest DS games in existence, <laughs> and being uh, sentenced to do every Naruto game from here until the end of time. Hey, when you do something well, you continue to do it, right? But look, but look what happens when you let them do their own thing. You make something great. <laughs> then you give it to a publisher like Capcom, and then, well, hey, let's just chop off the last fourth of the game and sell it for eight bucks. <laughs> now, that was in Capcom's really bad years. I mean, right now they're kind of juggling back and forth. It's like, do we trust the Switch? Do we not? By the way, here's a Monster Hunter game just to tide you guys over. See, Capcom, they're just the most human publisher ever. They do good things, they do bad things, much like uh, the, uh, the much like you and I, you know? They're not pure evil, they're just sometimes really stupid. Yeah. <laughs> okay, going back to crossover fighters, why the hell is there a monster hunter in Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite? Besides being an easy way to sell the next monster hunter game. You want to sell monster hunter to me, you should put Osara on it. All I know! jump around, punch things, and it's like, who cares about resource management? I just want to fight! See, like, Marvel vs. Capcom is supposed to be, like, game first, advertisement second. That's the way I felt with Ultimate 3 and the regular 3. But this one just feels like such a cash grab. Go watch the Marvel movies. By the way, buy our Capcom games that are coming out this year or next. Oh, Infinite sucks. <laughs> Special thanks to Yoshinori Ono. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thanks for making Street Fighter, I guess. <laughs> thanks for letting us borrow your characters. Thanks. And all of Capcom is, staff. It's a really long credit sequence for just a short little episode, you know? I think I know the reason. They needed a lot more programmers to figure out how to turn Ostara the action game into a, a 2D <laughs> fighter. Well, imagine if that's how Asura was in the Street Fighter games. You know, he didn't have the, the typical Dalla Ford Fierce. You know, you, you had that slow kind of drudging movement, and you had those uh, same button prompts. Imagine how cool that would be. But nope. D but nope. You gotta hide him, hide all these rights and all that, and we're never gonna see Asura in another thing ever again. Yep, there we go. 
developed by CC2, produced by Capcom, and published by Capcom. So that's Do why we haven't seen them anywhere published? else. I mean, they should be able to put them in more things. Ah. They put Capcom's fingerprints all over it. It makes sense that Osura would be in more Capcom <laughs> games, but no! We gotta have old uh, man Frank Woost in Dead Rising 4. Hank East. <laughs> uh, you know... I took, I took uh, too much time on the on the 2D part, but... Oh, you know, God, you, you're just terrible. <laughs> S-ranks don't matter in this part. It's okay. just doing the missions, which I will show off now, because you don't even get any sort of illustration or anything. Just dump you back. Here's oh, the mission list. Oh. I've done all of them, and trust me, it was an absolute bitch. Especially that perfect KO thing. So we'll just go ahead with, and just end with get a KO in 40 seconds. See if we can hmm. do it. Because what that does is it skips all the story stuff and takes you right to the 2D fight. Okay, so this isn't, like win with the burst gauge. This is just knock him out. Yeah. Okay. Let's see how we do. But I forgot he likes to fucking block everything. Block everything and you can't throw. At least I assume you can't throw. Not that I know of. Like maybe if I do a special uh, butt prompt maybe. I don't know. Mm, nope. Still blocking. Like a little blocky boy. Oh crap. Halfway done. You have to... Pull something out of your ass, come on! Oh, that's not right! No! Oh, God, look at that chin! Woo! That barely did anything to you. Alright, I can do that too, check it! And... Oh, you gotta be... You gotta be <laughs> kidding me! <laughs> oh, Fuck. God. Yeah, if I'm about to punch you right in the face and time runs out... You still get punched in the face, all right? It's... <sighs> Whatever. See you next time on Osiris Wrath. We'll be doing the second of the Lost Episodes. And then after the second Lost Episode, we'll get back to the fourth arc. So, uh, see you next time. Oh, God.